Day Planet. How's it hanging? We join you this time from Uruguay, from a small town called Salto. Now, near Salto was discovered these hot springs where the water is pumped up from the magma under the earth at a steamy 45 degrees Celsius, which is about approximately 9 billion degrees Fahrenheit for all of you watching in the United States. Um, and they're known for their healing powers, so we're here to rest up for a couple of days. Uruguay has a rich and vibrant and lovely history that I learned from a man called Luis in Montevideo. If you want the real history, you can pause and Google. If not, listen on. To help explain the history of Uruguay, I've carved some small wooden figures to help tell the story. The two big powerhouses in South America are Argentina, this little man with a gun, and this man from Brazil. His gun broke off. Sorry about that. In between, sandwiched the, between these two big countries, is this little cute fella. Ah, uh, Uruguay. Hello! Now, for centuries, Argentina would fight over Uruguay. It's part of Argentina! And they'd take it. No, 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 it's part of Brazil! And they'd take it back. Finally, the British people, I don't know why they were here, got fed up of it. Hello, 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 what's all this then? Uruguay is mine! No, Uruguay is part of Brazil! Well, I'll set all this. Oh, sorry, Uruguay. Uruguay is part of itself. Uruguay is its own country. And they lived happily ever after and went for a swim in the thermal springs together. And that is how Uruguay was born. It was born out of peace. It was born to, born to bring people together. Born out of love. And that love lives on in Uruguay to this very day. Why, in our hostel, a man, for the first night, was feeling the love for at least an hour by himself in our dorm room. In the tent next door in this campsite, the couple was loudly feeling the love for quite a long time. And even the water here is suggestively and lovingly titled H2. Oh, I'm feeling the love in Uruguay. I hope you are too. We'll see you next time in Paraguay. Adios, amigos.